Santa Monica, we're a coastal community and we've been leading on sustainability policy for over 25 years. We were one of the first communities in the world to have a sustainable city plan. And what that plan did was basically establish environmental metrics for the city to measure itself against and gave us targets for which we should strive to achieve. So reducing our waste, reducing our water use and making sure that we're using energy in the right way. I want you to help uh, the concierge out, take your uh, sales team around, uh, lead, the, um, lead the tour of the children when they come in. We are uh, opened up LEED Gold certified, and since then we decided to become sustainable in our operations. That means uh, we have energy conservation, we have water conservation, and we do operational conservation as well. So on the, on the energy side, we've been changing uh, even more of our lights to LED. Uh, now we've saved about 31 million uh, watts of uh, energy over the last um, seven years. Um, we also have a demand response that we work with on um, Southern California Edison, where we shut off our electricity to 50% for about four hours during peak times uh, throughout the year. So we signed up with that. Today we do have many check-ins, so just make sure that everything's smooth coming in through the front door. Uh, make sure John Paul is there. Sustainability is a huge topic here in Santa Monica, and for our hotel, it is huge as well. Uh, leading the way in sustainability and being responsible within the Santa Monica community is one of our top initiatives here at the Hotel Shangri-La. Uh, it even dates to 80 years ago when we were built in 1939. Uh, a lot of the modern aspects and building uh, that was done during that period was itself sustainable. Uh, for example, uh, we have open corridors throughout the whole hotel, uh, which is used as natural air conditioning conditioning and its design. Uh, so basically the air coming off of the ocean will filter in through these open corridors, filter through the windows and prevent, uh, cause a cross ventilation uh, to the outside windows. So it was natural air conditioning itself, less energy consumption.